वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग टू वन एंड ऑल आज अपन सिंहगढ़ टेक्निकल एजुकेशन सोसायटी तर्फे आयोजित अभियांत्रिकी प्रवेश मार्गदर्शन व समुपदेशन हा कार्यक्रमा जमले आहोत्त ये उपस्थित सर्व विद्या व पालक मी डॉक्टर शीतल घुरफड़े असोसिएट प्रोफेसर मैथमेटिक्स आर एम डी सिंहगढ़ स्कूल ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग हार्दिक स्वागत करते आज कार्यक्रम के प्रमुख वक्ते श्रीयुत अभय अभ्यंकर व सिंहगढ़ टेक्निकल एजुकेशन सोसायटी दहा अभियांत्रिकी महाविद्यालय प्राचार्य प्राध्यापक वेड़ वे काढ़ अपना मार्गदर्शना उपस्थित है मनापास स्वागत भारतीय संस्कृति परंपरेनुसार कुछ ही शुभ कार्या सुरुआत अपन सरस्वती वंदन व दीप प्रज्वलन करूँ करो मनुन मी अभ्यंकर सर डॉ प्राचार्य डॉक्टर सी बी बंगाल डॉक्टर ए बी देशपांडे डॉक्टर एस डी लोखंडे आलक दोन चार प्रतिनिधि विनंती करते कि व्यासपीठा सरस्वती पूजन आ दीप प्रज्वलन करूँ कार्यक्रम सुरुआत करा अभियंत्रिकी प्रवेश परीक्षे निकाल जाहिर झाले। खरतर परीक्षा संपलापासन निकाल लगेपर्यंत मनात भीति संपली पम्रम मात्र सुरू जाए सग घर सग सतत चर्चा और वाद विवादाला ऊत आलच कुछ महाविद्यालय प्रवेश घवा हव्या तो महाविद्यालय प्रवेश मिले ना हवी ती शाखा मिले ना एक ना अनेक प्रश्न मनुन मटत आज से अपने प्रमुख वक्ते नहीं खरतर प्रवेश गुरुच अपने मनात हा स शंका नक्की दूर करती हमें मला खरी है अपने प्रमुख वक्ते श्रीयुत अभय अभ्यंकर हे एम ई मेकैनिकल तीस वर्ष अध्यापना व समुपदेशना अनुभव है तीन लिखले नौ पुस्तक पुने मुंबई काश्मीर व इतर विद्यापीठांकून संदर्भ ग्रंथ मनु शिफारस कर डॉक्टर ए बी देशपांडे प्रिंसिपल श्रीमती काशीबाई नोले कॉलेज ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग वड़गाव आ डिरेक्टर सी व वड़गाव कैम्पस विनंती करते कि अभ्यंकर सर पुष्पगुच्छ देवन तेजे स्वागत करावे मार्गदर्शन कि समुपदेशन हा प्रकार मैं गेली दहा वर्ष करते अर्थात स्पष्ट खरे मत मांडत कुछ कॉलेज वती कार्यक्रम कराया मजा कभी वे आई नहीं अर्थात सिंहगढ़ कॉलेज ही माला पूर्ण स्वतंत्र दी आज का ही कार्यक्रम हा स्पष्ट खरी मत माना तुम्हारा सगत जास्त उपयोग होगा सग्या गोषी हिंदी मिलती 
अर्धा शेवटचा विचार तुम्ही करायचा असतो आपल्या पालकांच्या मनात असलेल्या वेगवेगळ्या कल्पना ज्या ओके ठीक आहे आय डोंट माइंड सो दिस इज गोईंग टू बी एव्हरीबडी इज ओके विथ इंग्लिश ओके सो आय विल बी क्लिअरिंग ऑल द डाऊट्स दॅट द पेरेंट्स ऑर द स्टुडंट्स विल हॅव ॲट द सेम टाईम you might be having some concepts some misconceptions something that you might know something that you should know all that will be covered in this and to begin this program whose uh, name is uh, next slide ek dolas pravas of course the name is in marathi it's an eye opener journey from your cet exam till engineering admission now why it is eye opener journey because it is a basically a journey and probably we only keep that view in front of us which is seen from your own window we don't look around we don't actually calculate the things we don't see from our eyes it will be probably the other parents the other students who are informing you as how this particular admission process goes out i happen to be the witness for the last 12 15 years right at the time when the process was uh, through counseling which was conducted in the government college of engineering long time back and everybody has to be present over there as per the merit number and you can see something like a screen like this where you can see whether the seat is available at your time and you will have to choose right at that time of course that process was continuing 24 by 7 at that time and all the students all over the maharashtra have to report to government college of engineering at that time but then slowly the things changed due to the development in it and now the process is online even the process is online for last 10 years and the process has changed so much that every year there is one thing or the other thing that is changing in the rules and that affects the allotment of course it is always moving in the positive direction it is for the betterment of the student last year they changed it to freeze float and slide so that you are not bound by which option whether it is first or first fifth option or so you can always fix that seat momentarily and wait for the next round so there is nothing like you will lose the seat if you go to the next round that is a positive change but then all this is happening over the period of time and if people are telling you that just wait and you are likely to get a, a good jump like you are allotted say option number 25 or 30 maybe you are likely to get directly option number 5 if you wait for the counseling round it's not the story now it has changed a lot so the things are to be calculated very properly it is very necessary that while filling the option forms you should fill it in such a way that you will get at least one allotment so that you can finalize that seat just by paying 5000 rupees at arc and put it as float i very well know that there are three options you can freeze it you can float it or you can slide it and i will explain all these but for the time being remember that almost all the students should be marking it as float and i will explain it in the due course so here is the ek dolas pravas we have several things in our mind we just get driven by whether i should choose the good college good branch and how should i give the sequence people ask me that uh, whether in college a i am getting mechanical and in college b i am getting computer which one is better now this is the funniest question i have ever heard because you can compare two colleges on the basis of same branch or you can compare within the college two different branches it is very difficult to compare whether college a branch mechanical college b branch electrical college c branch computer which one is better no 
no such a comparison if you are making right now that's going to be the totally wrong approach are you getting me what i'm saying this is very difficult and this nobody can do because the parameters for checking the particular option whether it is good or bad it will have several other things affecting it right from the status of that college the placement facilities the teaching facilities the infrastructure and so many things and don't be under the impression that college a is ranked as so and so means all the branches are equally good no no there can be college b which is at first position compared to this particular college so we will have to compare it very cautiously it's eye opener journey because now you have hardly any time i have been conducting these lectures for a month or so in marathi in just for the branch selection in english also but somehow uh, people are still attending these that means still there are people who want to know about it now once we start this journey which you have already started and you hardly have how many days four days five days with you because on 19 that is tomorrow the merit numbers will be declared those are provisional then on 22nd you will get the final merit number from 23rd to 26th you are supposed to fill in the options for round number 1 this everybody knew but then from today that is 18th till 23rd we hardly have 5 days and now we are required to think in this particular manner and create our option form so we we have less time yes but we can very well do it if you read particular persons options the sequence then one should know the thinking process of that person it should not be chosen randomly and it should not be copied too because if somebody has filled the option sequence in one manner then you simply copy it for you that's going to be a wrong approach because everything is different everything differs and it will be a good practice not to share your options sequence with anybody else because obviously we have so many limited seats that if your friend is securing rank higher than you and he fills the options in the same manner then he is likely to get the seat but you may not it sounds some somewhat selfish but one has to be we can't help we can't share our option sequence with anybody we should not because we are taking efforts to create the option sequence 